Hey guys, uh, another quick tutorial on the WPSD um, hotspot software that really was, it, it had me scratching my head and finally I found it somewhere on the internet and uh, I'm going to share it with you. Have you ever had trouble with uh, Brandmeister and changing the API key on WPSD? Um, when I first started the software up, I accidentally wiped out my uh, API key cause, out of frustration because I couldn't get the software to work. So I went over to Brandmeister, got the new API key, came back over to WPSD and could not for the life of me figure out how or where to put that new API key in. And that's what I'm going to show you today. So now what I had done, and I'm sure that um, a lot of you uh, new guys, just like me, I'm a new guy too on this uh, software, you probably went to admin and then you went to Brandmeister Manager. Wait for this to load. And then you look around in here and there is nowhere to change that um, API key. You can go through every one of these and you will not find it. And where I found it um, is you go right up here to Advanced. Then you go to host file editors. Uh, no, I'm sorry, it's not. It's, uh, is it tools? Here it is. No, no, that's not it. <laughs> I gotta find it myself, guys. Here it is. You go to full editors, come down to DMR, go over here, and go to Brandmeister API key. All right. And there is your key. That's, you wipe this out, you put the new key in, apply changes. And you're done, guys. And that is how you change the API key on your WPSD software. So again, to, to show you where it goes, um, you go to Advanced, go to Full Editors, go to DMR, and here it is right here at the bottom, Brandmeister API key. Click on that, go in, wipe out the old key, put in your new key, and you're back in business. All right, guys, that's all I got for you. Again, uh, ring the bell, subscribe, do the, all that nice stuff for me, and I appreciate it. And I hope this helps. Thanks.